What's going on YouTube? It's Cleo Thomas, aka Mr. Slick Living here with another great video. I wanted to try something different, so I'm giving you guys a brand new segment. Depending on you guys' reaction, I don't know whether to continue doing these type of videos or not, but I do think you guys will enjoy this. This segment is gonna be called Rolls Before Holds. Now, it's no secret to me or anybody else, I'm zero. Everyone knows that. I know that, you know that, your mother knows that, your teacher knows that. I'm pretty much the black Harry Potter. But um, another thing I noticed is the fact that a lot of people don't know how much work was put in before you guys even ever saw me. So I wanted to take the opportunity to show you guys projects that I had done before Holes. See, people think the overnight success thing just happened. To everyone in the world, I just came out of nowhere. They were like, yo, who is this kid? Cause I didn't come from the Disney Channel. I didn't have a show or anything like that. I just came out of the blue. But in reality, I had been working, I had done other projects. So I wanted to share one with you guys uh, today. It's a show that I was on, I guess started on as a very young kid called City Guys. It starred a good friend of mine, Wesley Jonathan. Some of you guys may know him as Sweetness in the film Roll Bounce that we did together. Crazy part is, me and Wesley Jonathan have actually worked together on four different projects over our lifetimes. And this is the very first time that we actually ever worked together. And I've always looked up to Wesley Jonathan. He's always been like a big brother to me. He took me underneath his wing immediately the first day he met me while shooting this show. So it was crazy to, you know, do City Guys with him. We do Badass together. It was a film by Mario Van Peebles about his father, Melvin Van Peebles, who was the first black independent film director. It was his story, so it was the struggles that he went through. I played Mario, Mario Van Peebles played his father Melvin, Wesley Jonathan played a Black Panther. It was a great film, I was very, very honored to be a part of that project. Then we got a chance to do Roll Bounce, and then we got a chance to do Remember the Days. Three films, one TV show that we worked on together. Big shout out to Wesley Jonathan, I just wanna thank him. Being a kind heart to a young kid, making his way in the industry at such a young age. I, I always looked up to him, and I just wanna say thank you, I do appreciate it. So let's get to the video. Rolls Before Holes, uh, my guest appearance on the show City Guys. Let's see what a young Cleo looks like. <laughs> Boys and girls, let's go in there and do exactly what we told you. <laughs> Dude, what are you doing? Dude, it's Barney. Dude, do we look like we're three? <laughs> Would you just go in there and do what you got to do when we give you a $10? Make it 20, and it's a done deal. Fine. Go. Let's go. $20? What's he gonna do, buy Pokemon? Buy Pokemon? Oh, hi, kid. I bet you're really excited about the Radiothon. That's what we came to. <coughs> Talk to you about. Oh, really? All us kids are a choo! Then, so they close the club. Forever. Oh, really? Gee, that's terrible. Would you kids excuse me for a moment? Shout out to Jordan Claire. That's the girl's name. Shout out to Jordan Claire. Two, three, one, two, five. What are you two, two doing? Three, one, two, all nothing, Miss Noble. Just showing Chris a little dance moves for the prom, that's all. Yeah, <laughs> and guess what else? I can't jump either. <laughs> you know what else you can't do? Skip the radio song. Oh, yes, we can. <laughs> no, you can't. <laughs> well, we tried. Looks like Ditch Day just ditched us. No, no, no. We'll think of something, trust me. It better be good. Look at his sideburn. You want to take it from the top? Shout out to Wesley's braids looking mad clean, bro. Wesley's braids look mad clean. Yo, that's crazy to see myself that young. My God, did you guys see the jeans? Go back and watch it again. You see how baggy the jeans were? See how baggy that shirt was on me? Oh my God. Um, That's one of my very first guest star roles. And I wanted to share that with you guys and also share the history between me and Wesley Jonathan, a fellow actor of mine, someone that I look up to and someone that I very, very much do respect. I want you guys to take inspiration from this as well, just so you guys can see that it's never overnight. A lot of work has been put in over the years to try and make it there and continue to keep going and continue to to get to that next level of success. Do me a favor, never take your accomplishments for granted. We live in a world and within the industry and the internet will almost make you feel like your accomplishments aren't enough. I know where I started and I know where I began and 
I look forward to all the great things that I plan on doing in the future. And I can look back on things like that and, and see myself so young and knowing even then what I wanted and what I, where I wanted to get to. I mean, other than, you know, the mystical twist that I had in my head and that baggy ass shirt, I can see myself, that's a young actor. Like I could look back at myself and see like in my eyes, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to be an actor and I wanted to bring a character to life. And I wanted to be a badass little kid who just suckered Wesley Jonathan's character out of $20. But I wanna thank you guys for tuning into my channel. This has been a segment called Rolls Before Holes. And depending on you guys' reaction to this video, I'll figure out if I'll bring some more things out of the old cassette so you guys can see me at such a young age and all the things that I had done before you guys ever even recognized my face. So thank you guys once again for tuning in. I go by the name of Cleo Thomas, AKA Mr. Slick Living. I'm out.